I'm a board certified internist, board certified in anti-aging and regenerative medicine, and fellowship trained in medical bariatric uh, medicine as well. I've, you know, I used to be, my former life was very traditional primary care medicine, where you saw the diabetics, the hypertensives, you know, the the high cholesterol patients, um, you have five, 10 minutes to see them, how are you doing? Here are your 10 other medications, how, you know, go lose weight, but I'll see you in six months, and that's about it. So very, very busy practice, but yet I always felt this, there was more that we needed to do as far as taking care of the patient as a whole. And they were at a loss as far as what else they needed to do. You know, it was just their medications and that was it, and I knew that there was more than that. So basically, practicing um, integrative medicine at this point brings the best of both worlds. I know exactly what the parameters and safety issues are when it comes to Western medicine. Um, I can tell patients when it is safe to discontinue certain medications or when it's not. And I can also guide them um, very uh, soundly with regards to um, supplementation. What are the other things that they can do in order to improve their health in general? Natural integrative medicine takes advantage of the knowledge base that is not just in Western medicine, but in Eastern medicine fields as well, together with cutting edge technologies um, with regards to personalization of health. It's not a cookie cutter approach. It looks at the individual, their particular health issues, there are particular stressors. We look at the mind, we look at the body, we look at stress and nutrition and how all of those are combined that lead to this particular individual. I do have a lot of patients who come in um, who are very frustrated when it comes to their medical care. They typically have gone to see multiple physicians, even specialists. They've tried different medications. They've Googled, they've asked their friends. There's so much information out there and they no longer know What's, what to believe and how to sift through all of that. So they come here and our role, my role, is to really weed out the information that is not relevant nor real for them and really zone in on their particular personal individual story and their symptoms and what led up to that. Because then that will help me guide them as far as making a comprehensive treatment approach, which will not entail only the traditional medical aspect of it, but perhaps these are individuals who will benefit from acupuncture therapy, or from neurofeedback, or instead of putting them on an antidepressant, what about looking at their hormones instead and really you know, address the underlying issue? So it's about going and digging deeper into what is causing it versus just putting a, a superficial Band-Aid on it. So the patient contact in our office begins when they book that visit. They are actually sent a link to fill out our questionnaire, a very thorough questionnaire, um, which looks not just their, their medical history, but the other stressors, you know, issues, questions about their nutrition, lifestyle, family history, all of that is filled out ahead of time so that I have a chance to review it prior to their visit. And then when they come in, we sit down, go over everything again, make sure everything's accurate because at that particular time, a patient will forget a few things. And there may be some questions that I would like to ask that will give me a better idea with regards to their particular concern. So that will take up um, you know, quite a good bit of the uh, consultation to really get a full story out. And then I do hands on my physical exam head to toe um, for both male and female. And then after the thorough history um, and physical exam, we sit down and create a plan. You know, what information do we now need in addition to what I already have in order to confirm um, any diagnosis I may be suspecting or any condition that I may, you know, I suspecting as far as what's leading to the patient's symptoms. And with the patient, we discuss that plan. We, we craft a general plan and then we hammer out specific tests that we now need to do in order to follow up in a few weeks. If appropriate, I will then start either supplements or um, prescription medications or hormones that are uh, important at that visit. If we do not have enough information yet in order to do that, 
then we will discuss the plans that we need to do and craft that out and bring the patient back um, a few weeks later to go over everything and then make a therapeutic plan with that as well. On top of that, I will review the dietary recommendations that I will have for them as well as lifestyle recommendations, you know, uh, address exercise, address stress management. So it's not just about here's a test, this is the result, this is what we do, but really looking more comprehensively and completely with the whole person. What I like most about working at Whole Family Healthcare are the practitioners and the people involved. Everybody is committed in a, in, in 100% as far as getting their patients to their desired outcomes. And everybody as well is committed to utilizing everything that they know of in order to get to that goal. So we are not just looking at standard treatments, we are looking at everything available, alternative treatments, integrative treatments. And everybody really has a heart of gold. You know, they're in it for their patients and they do care.